Feather from Grepax. In this Krita video, we will be showing you four ways to copy and paste in Krita and show and discuss some of their purposes as well as functionality. Open Krita, import the image you would like to utilize. Once this is done in Krita, consider if you will copy the whole image or just a portion. For our example, we will use just a portion. In order to do this in Krita, go to the toolbox, clicking on the rectangular selection tool. Then to the Krita canvas, drawing a box around the section of the image to be copied. Then go to the Critic toolbar, clicking on Edit. Scroll down to Copy and click. Then go back into Edit and scroll down to Paste and click. Notice this has created another Krita layer. Although it appears as nothing has changed, in order to see the copied portion, shut the layer eyelet off of the original image. Once this is done in Krita, now notice you can see the portion you chose to copy and paste. Now, by highlighting the layer of the copied image or portion, you can resize and or reposition the image how you would like. For this example, although I have chosen to add another layer, there is no need to, as Krita places each one on its own layer. Also, I will skip copying the portion as we go further in our example because I already have copied it. Go to the credit title bar, click Edit, scroll down to Paste at Cursor Location. Notice where the copied image appeared off to the side. The reason for this is because I did not utilize a hotkey for this function and this is the location Krita picked up my cursor or mouse if you will. Once this is done in Krita, go to the toolbox clicking on the move tool moving your image to a proper place on the canvas. Then, using any other of the other tools for manipulation like size adjustment and so on. Next, for this Krita example, we will be using the paste into new image function. If this is your first time utilizing this function, Krita may bring up the new document window in order for you to set the dimensions you wish for that image. If this happens, set your Krita dimensions and click Create, as this will place the copied image in a new work group for manipulation. Being that said, go to the Krita title bar, click Edit, scroll down to Copy in New Image, and click. So, why a whole new work group? You may ask. Well, I am sure there are a few reasons, but probably the most prominent is you may want to use the copied portion within a Krita project 
not related to the whole image. So, for this part of the critter example, and to show you what I mean, I will close out of the first part of this example without saving. But if you created something you like, please save it first. Now notice I am only left with the one critter work group with the paste to new image portion. Next for this credit example, go to the title bar, click on edit, scroll down to paste as a reference image and click. Once the reference image appears, just resize it real quick by dragging one of its lines on the edge so as to see the other image on the canvas. We will talk more about this critter function in a minute. For this part of the critter example, I will just paste the image and then resize it utilizing the transform a layers or selection tool. While I'm resizing, take note of how our critter reference image turns slightly transparent. So, let us talk about our reference image. Although you can see the Krita reference image on the canvas, if I was to export the image, the reference would not be part of the image exported, as it is only a reference. So, the purpose of the reference image is to look at the image for possible placement and alignment and look for a possible image that looks good in a position you would like to place it. But a problem exists. I have off-clicked from our Krita reference image. So how do I gain control of the reference image. Go to the Credit Toolbox. Click on the Pin Note tool. It should then show a box around the reference image. If for some reason it does not, then click on the reference image and it will appear. So, how do we remove the Critter Reference image? While being on the Pin Note tool in the toolbox and the reference image highlighted with its box, go to Edit, scroll down to Clear Delete, and click. Now notice our reference image is now gone. I hope you have enjoyed this Krita tutorial and found it helpful in some fashion. And if so, then why not give this video a like. And while you're at it, why not become a subscriber and ring that bell in order to be notified your way of newly released videos. <laughs> I mean, after all, ladies and gentlemen, it is free. The beginning and the end of this video has been provided by none other than Alex Abayu One. Thank you in advance. I am out.